Four Israelis have been killed in an attack by two Palestinian men on a synagogue in Jerusalem. At least eight others were seriously injured. The two men burst into the synagogue during early morning prayers, armed with meat cleavers and a gun. They were killed by police officers at the scene of the attack. No group has claimed responsibility, but the Popular Front for the Liberation of Palestine said the men were members. They've been identified as cousins Rassan and Uday Abu Jamal from the occupied East Jerusalem district of Jabal Mukaber. The latest violence comes after months of tension between Israelis and Palestinians in Jerusalem. There's anger over Israel's 50-day war on Gaza, which killed more than 2,000 Palestinians, and tensions over plans to build more settler homes in occupied East Jerusalem, as well as clashes with right-wing Jews who want to pray at the Al-Aqsa Mosque. At least six Israelis have been killed in two deadly attacks by Palestinians over the past few weeks. And on Sunday, a Palestinian bus driver was found hanged in his bus and Hamas called for his death to be avenged.